In this video, we'll take your context menu from looking like this to this. And to do that, we'll need an app called Context Menu Manager. And I'll leave its link in the description. After you click the link, go to Releases and download Context Menu Manager. .zip. This is what my context menu looks like right now. It's full of useless items. To start disabling these items, open Context Menu Manager. On the left side are all types of context menus. For example, when you right click on a file, these options will show up. When you right click on a folder, these options will show up. All objects show up in every context menu. You get the point. I'll start with the folder context menu. I want to disable these get items and the wish 3 item. Go to context menu manager on the folder and disable. You can see even when I disabled wish 3 in context menu manager it's still showing up so that means it's still enabled in another context menu it's showing in directory and we also found the git items you can see now that they're disabled while i'm here i'll disable open powershell window here also onedrive encryption microsoft defender always available offline give access to work folders and open and windows terminal some items need windows explorer to be restarted for the changes to take effect. The background context menu is when you right click on a white space. So I'll also disable them from here. I'll also disable some more items. On the folder context menu, I never use include in library item. It turns out that this is the include in library item. And to verify that it is, I'll disable it and it's gone. You should go through every option in this context menus and disable items that you don't use. You can also customize the new sent to open with and win x items i'll declutter the new context menu right now i want to keep photoshop text document and folder and i'll disable the rest it now looks like this if i've provided you with value so far please consider subscribing on file types you'll find context menus that show up whenever you right click on a specific file extension this is the context menu that shows up when i right click on a .gpg file to declutter this context menu go to specific file type and choose a gpg file extension i'll disable rotate right to disable these three items go to perceived file type and choose image file to disable scan with microsoft defender go to file and to disable add to favorites also on file toggle off if you can't figure out what context menu a file or folder belongs to you can drag it to the menu analysis these are all the context menu this folder uses 